All right, before we hand the reins of the radio station over to Rozak, we need to go back and uh, touch on some of the things we learned today here on the Woody and Wilcox Show. Yeah, what did we learn today? We learned that apparently there's a new trend, ladies. If you weigh over 200 pounds, your gynecologist may not take you in anymore. And let me tell you, Mel and Chelsea are not one bit happy about this. Yeah. Speaking of that, there seemed to be a theme on the show today. We learned that right now on Craigslist, you can get yourself a green, eco-friendly menstrual cup. Available for a mere, what was it, $20? It was 20 bucks. 20 bucks. It's a steal, baby. Uh, we also learned, speaking of Craigslist, that there is a dude and several others who uh, will take your goods. If you believe that the world is actually going to end on Saturday, he's more than willing to take anything you've got that you don't need. Money, worldly goods, and so forth and so on. We also learned that if you've got a uh, an anniversary coming up like Woody did this weekend, yeah. never mind grabbing the VCR out of the shed and watching your wedding video on VHS, yeah. there's a 67-year-old woman who'd like to teach you how to have an orgasm. Uh. All you got to do is see her in Sweden at her hotel. It comes with a bag of toys, by the way. And we learned that Arnold Schwarzenegger, you know him as Ben Richards, the governor of California, apparently had sex with his maid and now has a 10-year-old child with her. He just admitted it publicly this morning. We actually have audio from their tryst right here. Always ends with squeeze your butt. Very romantic, though. I can see why he was able to woo her. Woo! Uh, and we learned that today is the day Creepy Jeffrey gets stuff thrown on him. Thanks to uh, Miss Sprint Cup, all the different sponsorships for all the cars. If Creepy Jeffrey doesn't know what they are, they're going on him. The video will be available later today at 1065.com. Anything else you missed, you can catch it there as well. Rozak on the radio next.